what's up, guys? So consider joining our locals. If you like the fact that we catch predators nationwide, it's not possible without you joining our locals. On locals, you get to see over 20 catches early, completely uncensored. You get to see live predator confrontations as they happen. And you get to support the movement that has an arrest in 43 different states and convictions of 24. We do travel the most and catch the sickest. It's only $7 a month. You get more early content than Rumble. We do big content dumps every single month on locals. And can't do this without you guys. Consider joining locals. conversation with you about what what happened here because i'm giving you that chance to talk i understand the police have shown up at your house before that was not us all right that was like i guess a whole separate thing hey, look man i'm not I, i'm not even <laughs> james like with everything we have recorded me reaching out to still call you and talk about it i'm doing you such a huge favor okay you, you, te you just texted me your life's f look man if you were 50 years old, um, I'd agree with you and do everything I could and do everything I could to make sure that happens. But you're not 50. You're, you're not 50 circling the elementary schools with an ice cream truck. You know what I mean? You're you're still young enough to where I think this can get addressed, dude. You you know you know what I'm saying, man? Yeah, I thought, I'm not gonna lie to you, man. Like, I no one this has been a problem, and I I know I don't like that problem. I know. And if I thought you liked being this way or whatever then I wouldn't take the time to talk to you and want to actually get it addressed, okay? So, yeah. where are you at right now? Let's talk about it. Um, I don't know, man. I just, I'm okay. going home. Okay, well, James, <laughs> I'm giving you the chance to talk about it right now in Seguin. Um, we can do it at your house, too, but I'm sure your roommate doesn't want to hear what, what we're going to talk about. Um, well, why do you want to talk in person? Why do I want to talk in person? Well, that already shows me that there's not accountability from your end, you know? And, yes, Absolutely, for your safety, because I'm six foot four and three hundred something pounds. Absolutely, it's going to be filmed so you can't tell anybody that I hurt you or blackmailed you or do any of that crap. Um, but you know, there's a reason I wanted to have an instigine, James. I don't want to bring your roommates into this because you understand that with Ariel, you just park right here at the gas station, dude. You understand with Ariel that it, that it wasn't. He, you know, that's that's not what puts you. That that's not how we figured out that this was. Yeah, you, know, you were like this, right? You know what I mean. Um, it was, you know, you, you know, it's like, it's been a couple years and that's why we just want to get it figured out. You know, I'm not telling your parents, I'm not going to Laredo or whatever the hell your family is. I'm just talking to you because you're a grown man, but you're not old enough to where I think this is going to be a lifelong, lifelong issue. You know what I mean? Well, why can't we do this over the phone? Oh, well, I, you know, I'm not doing it over the phone because... If you, I want you to show me that you, you can take accountability for this. Doing this over the phone doesn't really show me that. It just shows me that this is kind of just a nuisance to you. You know what I mean? And, you know, I came a ways away to come talk to you. Like, you know, I'm not from Laredo. You know where Catula is? Yeah, I do. Yeah, I'm originally from Houston, moved to Catula. And, you know, <laughs> it's, not a, it's not an easy drive. It's not really that far, but it's not, a, you know, with these gas prices nowadays. So I, I came to talk to you about this in person, James, um, you know, and I, I could take my ass to your house. I could wait here, you know, and I could wait till you go to HEB. Like it's, it's not <laughs> like it's, I'm giving you a chance to talk about this because one, one way or another, I'm getting these messages and these phone calls taken care of. And I'm willing to just do it with you, man. I'm willing to just do it with you. So um, you know, I, I am, I am literally giving you a way out and I'm, I'm giving you a way to get this taken care of. I'm giving you a way to, you know, yeah, sure. Accept responsibility. But you know, I think we can turn this around because look, I'm going to tell you right now, I don't think you need trouble. I just think you need some help. Okay. So where are you at right now, man? Like, honestly, I don't know this area, but I'm, I'm going back. Okay, so let's not do the apartments where everybody can hear what's going on. Um, <laughs> I don't like I said, I'm not trying to like tell the world like, oh, hey, he's doing this, you know. Um, well, I mean, you're recording it, so isn't that for your content? Not for content, James. You understand how many things 
James, if it was about quote unquote content, do you understand how long we've had to post quote unquote content pertaining to you? What do you mean? I don't, I'm sorry, I don't understand. Basically, James, I had a whole, I don't know how many months or I don't know how many years. James, it, James, like if I wanted, to, if I wanted to, if this was to for blast or whatever, you understand that we've had a lot of time to do that. It didn't involve me driving like an hour and a half, right? Yeah. Okay. How, where, where, how far are you from the apartments right now? Um, I don't know, maybe about 10 minutes. Well, do you have the directions in? Uh, two, yeah, I, hold on. Uh, let's see. I eight minutes away. Okay, so how about let's meet at the entrance and um, let's go, like I don't want you to be, I don't want to go to a private place to where you feel unsafe, but a private place to where nobody can hear what's going on but us. How, how does that sound? That's fine. Okay, let's meet at the entrance. Wait, what? Let's meet at the entrance of the apartment and then we'll go from there. Can we stay on the phone? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Uh, so, why, why did you let it last so long? And how did you make it so convincing, like? Well... How's it going? Could be better, but... For sure. Good handshake. Okay. Yep. Yeah. So obviously, you know, obviously these are for protection. This isn't, you know, because I'm a bigger dude and, you know, whatever. You could have a shank or something in San Antonio, right? But, um, okay, so lots to unpack here, huh? Do you, do you work at, you actually work at the H-E-B? Uh, not that one. You just gave a fake one? Yeah. Okay. Happens. Well, you don't need to tell me which one, but we're just curious, what do you do at H-E-B? I'm a pharmacy technician. Okay. So you actually do something valuable for people? I, I think so. Good. Well, there you go. That's a... Uh, that's literally what I, that's literally what I respect, man. You're not so, you're not some you're not some fifty you know you're not like a sixty year old like on disability who uses that money to go drive around elementary schools and look at kids, right? So, um, you know, obviously there's quite quite a few things over the past I think couple of years to unpack with this type of stuff. Years. Or how recent did this start for you? Just with her. Just with her. Yeah. Okay. Well, you you mentioned. Oh, oh like oh yeah like. That's the first time I interacted with someone that age, but okay. before, like, I just had interests in younger people, but I was like, that's not bad. Right. I can't, can't think that way. Just kind of like a, was it kind of like a, you know, you're out like a bakery or something and you just see a bunch of chocolate cake and you're like, oh, it looks so good, but I'm not, I can't, I can't yeah, be having that. Basically. Okay. Got it. So I, I guess I'm curious about that. When did that kind of be a thing? Um, I guess a couple of, maybe when I... Couple, a couple years. years ago, I'd say maybe about four years ago, when I moved to San Antonio. A bit. From Laredo. Yeah. Well, technically no, but I've been around Texas. Okay. What's what's been your favorite place to live so far? Just curious. San Antonio. Yeah. Good food and uh, people here. Um. So, what do you think it was that kind of started it or kind of triggered it? Oh, man. Like, I just my interests were just not maturing with money you know what i mean mm -hmm. like you know how you have crushes in high school sure these, these girls look they look they way the way they are of course I, mine didn't really climb with me right like i don't have as much interest in girls my age do you do you i mean if you had to guess one big one good reason for that i mean i like short girls that's me too yeah. me too but but like if, if there had to be like a reason why do you, why do you think that didn't progress and it's, it's not like you know i'm not knocking you for it. i'm just asking why, why didn't progress? yeah like like you know you're 22 and maybe still like 17 year olds or something you're 23 still like 17 you're like you know like how come th why do you think oh, that man. that gap started know, it's just how my brain worked i guess okay that's fair and i, I wish i could tell you better answer. yeah no and no worries there's no wrong answers dude um so was when did kind of telegram start for you with, well that stuff mm -hmm. with her but um I, I had like i said i protect my friend that didn't have a phone and we just messaged through telegram on telegram yeah okay when did when did that person was it a she or a she he. when did he tell you to kind of get on telegram a couple years ago maybe a couple years ago okay 
And on Instagram, is there anybody like, what did you kind of start looking at there? Because I noticed the followings kind of that type of stuff, like younger. Really? On Instagram? I don't really follow that many. At least I don't think so. Not that I remember. If you, I mean, I'd like to see. Sure, sure. Oh, those, the ones that I sent were like those requests? Not the requests. Oh, then. So just kind of like this Carla Gons girl. Uh, There's another chick I think that said, or at least on a profile said 13 years old. Like kind of just not really too young, but just kind of like that teen those teenager ages. Sure. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Like this person here. I don't know. I don't know if I remember following them, but I mean, I, it looks like I do. Uh -huh. What was the question again? So when did you kind of start looking at pictures like this? Like not necessarily anything bad, but just kind of selfies pretty and recent. pretty recently. A couple of years ago. Maybe, maybe even last year. Maybe even last year. Three okay. Years. Where did those pictures kind of start getting displayed to you? Instagram. Instagram. Like uh, suggested. Okay. And then you know how um, your what's it called explore page? Yes. So yes. I just go from there. So it snowballed for the snow globe, pretty much. Okay. Yeah, man, and I'm, you know, I'm just gonna put this out there. I definitely don't think social media is helping any of this for anybody. And, you know, I think if this was, say, 30 years ago, maybe the situation wouldn't be happening. I think social media is really toxic. Like, you know, I, uh, you know, I have, I have a girlfriend and I see one nice bikini picture of like, you know, some Latina with double Ds. Click on the picture, just like, oh, nice. Then next thing you know, my whole explore page is that. And so is that kind of what happened with this? Okay. And you said that was like, what, last year, a couple years ago, yeah. something like that? I've been trying to clean it up, and I've gotten better at it, so I don't see much of that anymore. Okay, what do you usually see now? Music stuff. Okay. Who's your favorite band? I don't really have a favorite band. I'm more of a producer. Okay. So I, I like Kanye West as a producer a lot. Nice. Do you like Kanye West for other reasons? He's a little crazy, but, I mean, he hey, 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 I like Kanye. I, I think Kanye West is freaking guy. hilarious. He's freaking hilarious. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I mean, you played guitar for her on video call, right? Okay. So you said this was the first time interacting with someone like Ariel? Yeah. Okay. So I assume that you, I mean, on the phone you said she was convincing, so you, you know she told you she was 13. Yeah. Oh, okay. But how did you get them to, like, video record? Well, so basically, I don't know how she did this, and like I said, I told you on the phone to be honest from A to Z. I don't know how she hid it from you, but basically she had something recording, I don't know exactly what it was myself because I don't live with her or anything like that. But she had something going with for the recording that was being broadcasted to us. And basically we were just able to hear everything. So when she did the whole little room tour, I've, how she hit it, I have no idea. She's a small girl. I, I would imagine there's something behind her. And that's why I tried to get her to show me what was behind her. Mm -hmm. I, I had skeptics, skeptical thoughts, but never got her to do it. And I'm not gonna force her to do something she doesn't wanna do. Okay, so you say, that's another thing, I guess we can jump to that point. That's another thing that I was kind of going to figure out today, because obviously the chats say what they say, right? It's what was said, what was said, you know, no taking that back. Talked about, you know, and kissing, the whole, the whole what everybody does with a girl. So you mentioned, you just told me now, I wasn't going to force her to do something she doesn't want to do. Yeah. How was that going to go today? Honestly, I was just going to let things happen if they happen but i wasn't gonna make it i was gonna take things too far to where i'd make her uncomfortable okay and if she was uncomfortable then i just stop well i actually respect the hell out of that so say for the, the, the or whatever you, you mentioned not forcing it going jet so so is that kind of so no like forceful no no nothing today no. okay so would would all of that stuff have been up to her to do today then yeah, okay yeah. okay uh, i don't i didn't want to initiate anything because I feel like since I'm older I shouldn't initiate anything yeah see you're not too bad there's there's a lot worse out there for sure okay so the farthest that would have gone today is purely consensual both parties have to agree to it just kind of today okay well I appreciate your honesty um, okay and you know I don't need to read through every single chat I don't need to embarrass you you know um, just I, I do want to go over this here you asked can I see you right now she said i'm too scared to share that online you said this is a private chat 
as long as we keep it to ourselves, it'll never go anywhere, I promise. Go anywhere else, I promise. So. The only reason I said that was try to get more proof that she was real. I wasn't really, I know it sounds stupid, but I wasn't really trying to see her. Mm -hmm. I've never asked her to see her before. And that was my, like, okay, is she real or not? Is she going to show me this? Mm -hmm. Let me just ask it. Okay. So you, you get the picture of what comes next. If she were to send it to you. If she was real, then I would have been like, okay, she's real. Like, maybe I'd be okay coming. Okay. So would you have shared that picture around? No, I wouldn't. No? Okay. Do you think you would have uh, maybe saved it for yourself? I probably would have saved it. Okay, that's fair. That's as far as I'll be. Got it, got it. So like I said, I mean, I don't think we need these. I think at this point you're honest enough to where we can kind of just forget about these. I'm fat, it's hard for me to reach. So I do got to ask, like you said, you mentioned the cops came to your house the other day. That was all a lie because um, I had skeptic, like skeptics that she was fake. So I had to block, like I just blocked her right then and there. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, she's fake. I'm just going to block her. Yeah. And then I unblocked her and tried to make up a lie. It's like to make it uh, okay to have blocked her. So all that was a lie. Like I've never, and the cops didn't show up. I don't, I can honestly say that. Okay. So they, they didn't show up to your house no, and they had no... They had no, everything I said was all right. Okay. About talking to other people. My, my, well, my friend's number did get leaked. Okay. And he got, that's where I got the idea. Of like, oh, my number got leaked. Okay. Oh, sorry. But, but you know, it was kind of mentioned, like, they said I was talking to these other people. What's kind of up with that? I only said that because I wanted her to, like, say, like, oh, I'm not that, that type of person. Because I wanted to try to pin it on her and try to get her to say things that she wouldn't have usually said. Like say things like what? Just, cu just like, curious. I, okay, that, that would, like, I am, like, not really flat out tell me that, like, I'm, I'm a fake, but, like, kind of crumble and, like, over herself, and then I can just block her from there. Okay. So, yeah, that was more kind of probing and stuff like that? Exactly. Okay. It was also talked about, um, you mentioned this was the first person this young I, I really like and she said well was there another person you said i can't really get into that i said that mm -hmm. so who is who is that was this like an online thing in person who is that i don't see don't, my memory is not that great i'm sorry um if you have the the, the, the chat I, i'm more than helping out. sure yeah yeah but i don't remember saying that. okay Did you get good grades in high school? You're a smart dude. Did you go to high school here in San Antonio? No. No. Florida. God damn it. I was more of a musician, so grades weren't my uh, worry. It was more of getting as high as chairs. Yeah, no, same. Uh, I was an athlete in high school. I was worried about going to the NFL. Then, I, then at like one of my first college practices, there's a giant black guy that blows me off the line of scrimmage. And I'm like, well, that's not gonna happen. <laughs> so, yeah. I mean, do you, do you still aspire to be a musician? Yeah, uh, that's why I produce and I make music. Oh, good shit. I mean, have you, have you been, uh, have you been, yeah, have you been like paid paid for it yet? Kind of, every listen is a, a song. I mean, uh, like a couple cents. Sure, and you're on SoundCloud or something? I'm everywhere, yeah. Nice, Jack. And we have a friend named Jack who's kind of kind of in your position too. Like, okay, so you brought the BTS shirts. Yeah. Okay, may I see them, please? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Well, it's not BTS. It's twice. Oh. Sorry, I'm I'm a I'm a guy. It's okay. So what's gonna look more feminine on me, a trans vaccinated T-shirt or this shirt? Uh, it's probably more manly. <laughs> Is this actually a two XL? No, it's just a regular XL. That's what she wanted. It's gonna look like a crop top on me. All right. Oh yeah. Backwards, but oh, it is. Yeah. These cookie cutter K pops. Wait, that's actually the back. Oh yeah, yeah. God dang it. 
God, I should have thought twice before asking her to get an XL instead of a 2XL. But um, shh. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> fuck it. <laughs> Shit. All right, yeah. Um, okay, whatever. We were cuddling, holding hands together. Okay. So this happens on Instagram, Telegram. Uh, what about Facebook or any other apps like that? Snapchat. Just Insta and Telegram. Well, I only talk to her on Telegram. And okay. My other friend, but we stopped using that. Got so it. it just, I literally only have Telegram for her. Is your other friend from here? Uh, no, he's from out of the country. Well, he went out of the country, and so. Got it. Were we all talking on Telegram before that? No. No, he went out of the country. Okay. Got it. So, I know a lot of the profiles you follow. I mean, how many of those other profiles do you reach out to saying hello or something like that? Not many. I'd say Not many. maybe one, one other one, but I stopped talking to them because I only talk to this person. Okay. Like when I, like I was interested in her. And so when I'm, in, I'm interested in a girl, I just only put time. Just on cut her. off all of everybody Basically. else. So who is the other person that was kind of talking to you? I think it was a bot. A bot? Yeah. How old were they saying they were? They didn't tell me any age. Okay. They just looked like maybe 17. Okay. So all like the, the Kayla profile, I think she's 14, and that other chick I showed you that was 13. Did they ever get like a hello from you or anything? Not, no, I don't, I don't remember. I don't even remember seeing their profile, so. Okay. I don't, I don't really initiate. Like I said, this, this is my first time actually going steps further into it. Yeah, yeah, if, of course. If I follow them, I just looking. Okay, got it. And you had Twitter at one point too, or X, right? Yeah, or it was Twitter when I had it. Yeah, yeah. When did you hop on Twitter for the first time? 2011. Okay, so when you were still a kid? Yeah. Okay. So when did, when did Twitter kind of turn into the same way Instagram turned into for you? Well, um, a couple of years ago, maybe before I moved to San Antonio, they had, like, uh, you know, some Twitters have their own niches, like uh, not safe for work Twitter. And yeah, the yeah, of That's course. How I, I went into there and then mm -hmm. it got worse and worse and then it got to the point where I mentioned I was like there were people selling menus and I was like I don't know about that I'm not going to get into that and that costs money so I'm not going to spend money just to see stuff like that. What were the menus containing? They all they said were just like um, face no no face uh, but they will show uh, parts different parts. Okay and different they, parts. They didn't tell their age. Okay. At least from the profile. So this is where you can kind of help me because obviously, you know, I'm sure as you know, there's a lot worse than you kind of floating around online. Um, I don't even consider you bad, I just consider you misguided, you know. Um, you mentioned to her that these menus were girls your age. My age? No, no, oh, girls, okay. girls your age is in uh, Ariel's age, okay, yeah. right. You mentioned that they were menus of girls your age. So, and, and, I, and I know Twitter before Elon Musk came was full of that type of stuff um, because you're not the first person that We've come across these used Twitter and saw menus, you know? So when did you start seeing, I mean, how many menus did you see of stuff like that? I'm not saying, not many, you, not many. how many, if you had, how often maybe? Often, maybe once or twice a week. Okay, I'm just like a 13 year old girl having a menu or something. I'm assuming they're 13. Um, they try to, I think what they do is on their profile, they like hide their age. The sure. Bio. Sure. So I was, I would think that they're that age, even though they're saying that they're over that age, like they're of age. You know what I mean? So what made you say like girls your age? Like how? How did? What were the? What were some of the indicators to you that you knew that these girls were younger, selling their menus? And I'm not saying they're selling them to you directly. I'm just saying selling their menus. That, that, what I just said that indicated like they hit their age in there, uh -huh. and then they said that they're older. So I just assumed they're probably younger. okay. And that's why I stayed. Okay. So how often on Twitter did you see like kind of other stuff that signified, not only not safe for work, but maybe signified like younger ladies under 18, stuff like that? Not much, other than those menus, but no pictures. No, no pictures, not much. No, like, so, like I said, once or twice a week, but it was, as far as I knew, it was all of age, not safe for work stuff. Okay. Have you seen anything, anybody advertising anything on uh, Telegram, on Twitter, like, hey, go to my Telegram, you can see some other stuff that he was probably not safe for anything. I don't have Twitter. No, but did you ever see that on Twitter? Oh, like, no, not not about Telegram. No, like okay. I said, I just found out about Telegram a couple years ago when I was talking to my friend. Okay, got it. 
And your friend, what country is your friend in now? He was in Vietnam. He was in Vietnam. But oh. he's back now. Okay, he's back. Do you still talk to him on Telegram? Oh, when was the last time you talked to him on Telegram? Last year. Okay. He came back uh, six months ago, back in May. Got it. Oh, so maybe around that time. So this year, but early in this year. Mm -hmm. Does he live here in San Antonio? Technically, he's he he went to Vietnam to like find himself, I guess, mm -hmm. and he doesn't have a place to stay, so he's couch surfing with his old brother's old place, and sure. then he's gonna go back to Laredo, and then he's gonna move back to Vietnam, I think. How long was he in Vietnam for? Like, he, he said he came back in May of this year? A year. A year? Yeah. Golly. Was he like your bestie growing up or something, or? No, just a good time. Okay. So is there anything you've seen on Twitter that maybe, like, cause, you know, these people online, like the really bad ones, they use like symbols to talk to each other. Like, hey, I got this, you know, I put an emoji. Have you seen anything like that that kind of could signify maybe pictures that people shouldn't be seeing? Not that I can recall. Not that you can recall. I, I see where you're trying to get these yeah. questions from, but I, I wish I could help, but not that I recall. So okay. I didn't, like, I didn't see much of that stuff, but when I did, I kind of avoided it. Okay, much of what stuff? Like inappropriate of younger age stuff mm -hmm. and on public spaces because mm -hmm. back then when i had twitter it was my personal twitter sure and i didn't want that stuff to reflect on i didn't want my followers to see that stuff of course so i kind of avoided it okay did you have a decent following on twitter at all i actually did uh how many Probably followers like 500 that's not bad yeah it's not bad so you said there's menus then there's the occasional like picture of that stuff that you didn't want to see Okay, who was posting those pictures of that stuff? Those, those profiles, I, I don't remember those profile names. Okay, the same profiles with the menus or other profiles? I'm assuming the one with the menus. Okay, and you know, I'm, I'm sorry you had to see some of those pictures. I'm sure they weren't pleasant to you. Um, when, what was happening? Were these videos or pictures or both that they were kind of posted? Just pictures. If it was a video, it was of them like in lingerie. And this was like, how old were these girls in, the, in those videos? They didn't show their face. Okay. How old do they look? That's hard to tell because their bodies are different. Yeah. So it's hard to tell what age they are just from seeing their body without, because it, it was neck down. Okay. Well, did it, did it look like if, I mean, did it look probably kind of young, like high school or younger? High school. High school? Yeah. Okay. So the times you've seen pictures, I assume, because you, you said if you, if you saw a video, it was just laundry. So I assume the pictures were the only that was shown? Mm -hmm. Okay. What were those pictures typically uh, showing like? Okay. Okay. And any faces in those pictures? No faces. Okay. So what, what would you say the average age of those pictures were if you had to put an age on it? I'm not saying, you know, you're an expert, but just like if you had to guess. 16. 16. Okay. And these were getting posted publicly on Twitter? Yeah. God damn. That's crazy. God damn. Okay. And how young did it go? Did it ever go to like maybe 13 if you had to guess? Maybe. I don't, know, a, I, didn't, I don't know of any type of girl that would really want to sell their body for money at that age. Well, do you, do you think, I mean, because you told Ariel that there were girls your age doing that. Yeah, I did. So, you did? Okay, so when have you seen that? Well, I'm assuming that they're 13. Okay. Their profiles are 13, so I'm, a, I'm assuming. Okay, and these were Twitter profiles? Yeah, well, okay. like, you know, when it's hidden in there. Yeah. Yeah, I would, I would assume that they're 13. So how, what do you mean by hidden in there? Like in what way? Like they'll say I have this many plushies or this many things, and then that's their code that like I'm this age. Oh, okay, I have 13 plushies yeah. or, okay. Do they ever say anything like I love the little things in life? Like what? Like they ever say a phrase like I love the little things in life? I'm sorry, say that. I love the little things in life? I've never seen that, no. No, okay. I have 13 plushies, this and that. So how many of those profiles were showing like of like the 13, you think? Mm, all the ones that I would, I would encounter. Mm -hmm. so we're showing Yeah. God damn, how do they allow that shit? I don't know. It's insane. And you know, I'm asking you because I want to figure out how it really works on yeah. those. It's not like me like, oh, because you know, it's, it's your public feed, you know, it's whatever. Mm -hmm. How often, or how many times did it go under 13, you think, like to prepubescent type stuff? I don't think that I ever saw, I've never seen 12, 11, 9, 8, whatever. You think 13 was the youngest I that you probably saw? Yeah. Okay. So how about on anything else besides Twitter? Did this happen? Nope, not that I've seen. 
Okay. Instagram, I try to I try to keep it as clean as possible. Even though I follow those some of that, uh, I try to keep it as clean as possible because it's my promotional page. Mm -hmm. Is Snow Globe your promotional page? Uh, wrong name, but it's a. Uh, I'm not going to change that name. So yeah. I'm going to keep that name. Yeah. Keep my promotions there. Sure. Sure. Because there's a page on Instagram that's in your following list called Young Pizza. Do you, do, you, do you know what pizza stands for or means online? Yeah. Okay, what does it mean? Um, I tell them. Hmm? Yeah. I've never reached out to them, I know that. Okay, did I probably, it... I probably followed it to see anything, but I've never reached out to them. Okay, did, did any of these accounts ever reach out to you? Because I've seen often where, I've seen often where, you know, maybe you're just trying to keep it at surface level, like bikini pics, whatever happens. But then these child profiles like these pizza pages they reach out to other people and suck them into something and i think that's what happened with you man not not well because i get requests for messages uh -huh. but i always ignore them all on instagram at least okay how many of these requests are like telegram links or saying hey come look at this stuff over here mm, all of them but they're not of that stuff they're like of other stuff like watches or music stuff like watches or music stuff yeah. okay well i mean your instagram following is I know, I kind of delve into the rabbit hole. Mm -hmm. to see what yeah, I find. And I think you've been sucked into it a few times. Yeah. Not, not, and again, like, are these your pictures that are, yeah, you know, you're taking yourself of kids or? Wait, what? Do you ever take pictures of no, kids yourself? No. no, no, okay. Yeah, man, I, I think what's happened is you've been sucked into the rabbit hole a few times. You know exactly what pizza means, which tells me you're not a rookie. Mm -hmm. um, I know you've seen pizza on Twitter. Well, I knew what pizza was because of like, it's Twitter and everything. Like they, they say what it means. Of course. Of course. But then on Instagram, you go ahead and follow pizza, knowing exactly what it means then. So that tells me there, there, there's something going on, man. Yeah, just, um, like I said, like I just delve into it. And some nights I go even further, or I try to go for it farther, but then I stop myself because I know it's not right. Uh, and that's why I don't, like, this is the furthest I've gone, like messaging someone about something. Right. And then further initiating things with that. So delving into what exactly? Like just looking at images like that or, okay. What images do you look at? Whatever they post. On where? Like what Instagram, like from, from the followings that you've seen me follow. Like the Young Pizza stuff? Yeah, well, if they post anything. Okay. I don't know, I don't really don't remember. Because I try not to have that on my feed either. Right. In case I'm scrolling everywhere. Right. And so I mute those. So you're trying to, you, you look at what they post, but then you want to clean up your explore page, which is totally fair. Yeah. So like I follow mm -hmm. them and then I mute them and then I forget about them. And then I go back to it. Yeah, I mean, there's a thing called Young Teenager Pizza right here. Mm -hmm. And, you know, if you've had Telegram, you said for a couple of years at this point, and then your buddy was in Vietnam for only, what, a year or something. I don't doubt you talked to him on Telegram or whatever, but it's just the realm of possibility of aerial, I get you. The I Viet Cong guy. I, I and understand then he, where you're coming from, but mm -hmm. I can honestly say that that didn't... Telegram wasn't my uh, path to this area. It was more Instagram, if anything. Yeah, I know. I, I know it starts at Instagram, but then I've seen so many times where people can get sucked into Telegram, okay? So it's even worse on Telegram? Well, I think I think you can tell me that part. I, I mean, I don't... Like I said... I, don't I, I think you do know. I think you do know. I mean, dude, like I told you, man, Ariel wasn't the only, Ariel wasn't the only thing we knew, you know? And that young pizza page, you mentioned you meet their posts. They don't have any posts on there. They don't have any posts on their Instagram. None of these pages have any posts on their Instagram. They have a lot of followers for some reason. They have like 700 followers and 20 following. Why? I don't know. That's why I follow them. Like maybe they post every now and then. Okay. But knowing they had zero posts, Maybe you don't remember they had zero posts, but you knew they had zero posts at the time you followed them because they have zero posts. Man, I don't think you would have gone this far with Ariel if, if they didn't if they didn't show you anything really fucked up off on Telegram, off they, of Twitter. I can honestly say they haven't. Like I, I, I'm being as honest as I can, being transparent. Telegram was not my place for that. Okay. So there, what there is a place for that. That's what I'm trying to figure out. That's why Instagram was. Okay, but they can't send you straight up. They can't send straight up just of younger ladies on, on Instagram. They have to do it somewhere else. Unless by some miracle they're getting through to you. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Like, they didn't send me anything. 
Okay. I, I didn't communicate with them. Okay. I just followed them to see if anything would be posted. Okay. So, but you mentioned delving into it and wanting to go further. Well, what does that like mean? Going to other profiles and seeing what they post or seeing like, um, I know I, I can almost tell the difference between fake and real. Mm -hmm. um, uh, and then I can tell that like when they're more real, like they'll be more genuine about their posts. Right. So I would dive into those posts and then like summer was around, so they post like bikini pics. Right, right, right. That's about it. And anything on Facebook of it, that sort? I don't use it. No. What, do you, what, what did you bring her from Chick-fil-A? Uh, sal the salad and the fruit cup. Yeah, I gotta get the fruit cup, please. Yeah. Thank you. Do you want the lemonade too? Mm, no, one of them can have it if they want. Oh, God bless you, man. Is there any actual chicken in here? Yeah, that's a chicken sandwich. I got it for myself, but... Oh, you can have it. Do you want... I'm not going to May I have it? Yeah. Thanks. There's no pickles, though. <laughs> no pickles. I would have taken pickles, but I didn't know if she didn't like pickles. Oh, yeah, you don't want to do it in Okay, hold well. on. Mm-mm-mm. Huh? You want to hold some? Yeah, sure. So sorry. It's okay. All over my seat. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. I can clean it up. Good. Have you been in Griff's Griff before? Griff's? Griff's. No, I never. Really good. Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Dude, white people Popeyes are so good. delicious <clears throat> okay appreciate you man so this is what I'm trying to figure out if this kind of curiosity started a few years ago for you right you mentioned it was just pictures online that was kind of being displayed to you okay so in four years you know you mentioned the only uh, whatever the of younger you've seen is like 13 year olds on Twitter or whatever. I think four years is kind of too too long for this to be happening without dipping your toes a little bit farther than that. And like I said, man, I'm not placing the blame on you yeah. for this happening, but I'm gonna tell you right now, when it comes to people like that online that are sending these pictures, producing these pictures, because you know it's not a 13 year old selling her body, right? It's it's an adult taking pictures and selling that, right? It's totally okay to snitch on that shit. Okay, it's it doesn't matter. You know, I, I've come across people who have seen infants getting tortured, all this type of stuff. I don't blame it on them. It's all their videos, but they help me have eyes where I can't go see. So that's what I need you to do, man. Because look, what what, what was said to her? Look, you were, I, I truly believe you weren't going to for all that stuff, whatever. Because you're just not that type of person to do that. But talking to this to a you know assumed 13 year old it doesn't it doesn't come from seeing a few on twitter man it, it doesn't come from that it has to come from some something really screwed up you, you mentioned that your friend in vietnam he has nothing to do with any of this i can tell you that. Uh -huh. but go ahead but you also said he doesn't have a phone number well 
it wouldn't work because it's international. Mm -hmm. I understand that. But couldn't he connect with you on Wi-Fi or anything like that with Perhaps, his phone number? But I guess he just chose Telegram. He just chose Telegram? Okay. But all of these pizza profiles, coincidentally, just all have Telegram, man. And look, like I said, I don't doubt you talk to him on there, but you know, there's so much shit that can happen on Telegram when you're dabbled into shit on Twitter. Um, let me just. Uh, oh. There's really so much. There's so much shit that you can happen. I mean, has anybody tried to DM you on Twitter selling that type of stuff or spamming that type of stuff to you? Not that I recall. Okay. I I, I really. I mean, I just know, dude. I mean, I could see. I could see it in your eyes. Somebody. Somebody is really. I think sent you some up shit or added you to something because i don't think this is you looking for it man i think at some point it turned into that but going four years kind of being curious about younger and then only I, seeing bikini pictures and topless pictures it I doesn't girlfriends between those years so I, okay like i said i sure when i'm with them so i kept pushed it away kept it on the log mm -hmm. and then i would go back after i break up with them okay i mean do you do you watch regular at all i do Okay. What do you usually type in and watch? Petite girls. Petite. Okay. What websites like Pornhub or what else? Just. Just. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, man. That, so that, that's my thing. You, you don't watch regular just what it's videos or whatever. You don't watch regular, and then when it comes to younger than eighteen, you see bikinis. It, it doesn't make any sense, especially if you're here right now. Because that's the thing. You're here right now. Yeah. This is, this is you wanting to act out something that I know you've seen. Because this, this doesn't, you, you didn't wake up one day and just being like, oh, yeah, I want to do this with a 13-year-old. I, I refuse to believe that, man. I don't think you're like that. That's what I'm trying to give you, the benefit of the doubt. Like, what if these people showing you online? I understand the public Twitter feed. I, I, I get that. But I don't think that turns you into this, man. I really don't. These all, I mean, that young teenager Instagram page, I mean, that is, that's a major player in the trading game on Telegram. That's a major player. And there's a few others, too. Like these younger profiles that are obviously adults posing as minors. Not like we did, but actual like, you know, to f*** them out and sell them and stuff like that. Okay? I mean, dude, y you need to tell me like just the truth about what happened. I, I am. I'm not, I'm being as transparent as I am. Like that's, that's everything. I know you want more information as much as you want, mm -hmm. like for, to help you and to help everyone in mm -hmm. that sense. But that's all the information I have. James, I don't believe that. I, 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 I mean, I, I, but there, like, there's, there's a disconnect here. It just doesn't make sense. I mean, yeah, I understand these pizza pictures being shown on a public Twitter feed. There's just no way you didn't go into somebody's DM, maybe, or somebody was DMing you with this type of stuff or asking if you have any of this or any of that stuff. I don't believe that, James. I don't believe that. At, I also don't believe that at some point, at, that at one point, if not now or at wherever, that your phone's been 100% clean of that stuff either. I don't believe that, okay? I might have believed it if he didn't show up today, but this is somebody who's seen some shit online, who's really seen some shit online. And I know you've reached out to other profiles that have been younger than 13, and I'm sorry, that have been around our Ariel's age or at least representing themselves as that. I know you have. Not, not as much as you might think. Okay, how often? Like once or twice. Okay, you know how I know that? Because we're also posing as one of those other profiles. I don't remember the name of it. We go through so many as well. Probably Carly. That's the only other one that I can think of. Okay, that you reached out to? Yeah. Okay. But I was like, no, I don't want to do this. I don't want to get doubled down. Where's Carla from? Where did she tell you she was from? Mexico? Yeah. Yeah, Carla's a few people off there. Messages on Carla. How long did y'all talk for? Like a week or two. Like a week or two. Did she ever get flirty with you? Mm, a little bit. In what way? Like, oh, I look handsome. Okay. That's about it. Got it. When, was, when did this week or two happen? Mm, maybe about three weeks ago. Okay. Or four, like a month ago. Like a month ago. Early September. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Early August. Sure, sure. Okay. Carla's followed by a lot of people who are kind of into this type of stuff. You know, Carla's a great bait profile, all right? James, for the, for Jesus, I mean, do you believe in Jesus? I, I'm 
not religious, unfortunately. Okay. But I, I know you're trying to get more information from me. But well, it's it's not about trying. It's it's up to you. To, it's up to you. It's up to you to tell me this, man. I can't, I can't force you to. I can't, I can't force it out of you. But you don't message the Carl account. You don't follow the young the young pizza thing, if they're not trying to at least spam you with the stuff. Maybe you've been spammed with it and you deleted it because you didn't want to see it. But I know there's something that made your mind come do this. It wasn't you. I don't think. I, I like to hope not. I mean, if you if you just decide that you want to go have with a 13 year old. Uh, uh, well, that's always all in my head. Like, do I really want to do this? Well, that, I mean, that's fine. But if, if you decide to come all the way here under those pretenses, mm -hmm. After seeing nothing of the sort online, maybe maybe you're a lot worse than I thought. But I, I really I really thought going into this, I'd have the benefit of the doubt. Give you, I, I really think there's some shit that these people have sent you online. Like maybe they did. I mean, did they ever add you to like a Telegram group where that's spammed and you leave it? I'm only a Telegram group so I've been in would be like for, but I get out of that. Okay. Because a lot of have been following me. A lot of have been following you. Yeah, like uh, people who sell. They've been following me recently. On Insta? Yeah. Okay. And then they try to get me to be on Telegram. Okay. Are some of these people selling the drugs? Like, are they local or just wherever the f from? Local. Local? San Antonio. Okay. Do you know them personally? I don't. Okay. How would they know you? I honestly don't know. I, I can honestly tell you, I don't know how these profiles find me or they, like, assume that I'm doing that. Yeah. I vape, but that's about it. No hard drugs or anything? Hard drugs, no. Do you do well? I don't care if you do. I, a little, sometimes. Yeah. I, I try to stop because yeah. I don't want to get fired. So. Oh, they did drug test you at H E B. Oh, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't care if you smoke. I mean, who doesn't nowadays? So they add you to these groups on Telegram. These drug groups. Okay. Or like, I mean, they're just selling their stuff. Okay. Are these like groups of people selling, or is this like one channel? Like, I, what is what's going I think on? It's one person mm -hmm. selling to a group of people. Okay, so it's a it's a Telegram group, but it's like drugs. Basically, yeah. Okay. What kind of pictures are they posting in there? Pictures of like the weed or capsules. Okay, the, the, these these are all San Antonio people. As far as I know, I, I wouldn't think that someone not from San Antonio would be on it because they only sell in San Antonio. Well, what's the group called? Um, I don't remember. Okay, are you in the group right now? Uh, I don't think so. Not. I'm in a different group now. Okay. Uh, cause this is my second one that I'm in now. But the first one I got out of cause I wasn't doing anything with it. What's the group called that you're in now? Uh, do you mind if I look? Um, sure. I see it too? Uh, I'd rather you not. Well, cool. all right. Menu. Let me just do that. See ya. Yeah. That's about it. Yep. So who added you for who added you to that menu group? Those dealers. Those dealers. Yeah. Okay. Do you know the dealers' names? Just their first names? I don't. No. And they connected with you. You said on Instagram? No. Uh, well, like when I buy, sometimes uh -huh. they have my number, so they just put me in the group. I'm assuming. Okay. Can you do that from Telegram? Like, can you just throw add your out? number? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I guess that's how they do it. Yeah. Okay. How many groups have they added you to? Just two. Just two. Mm -hmm. Okay. When, when did the first one happen? Maybe about two months ago. Two months ago. Okay. Has there ever been any other groups they added you on Telegram or any other groups? Nope. No. Okay. Are you sure, man? I am. I'm, I, I'm being as honest okay. as I can. I, I don't want to get you upset. You seem like you are. Um, but I can honestly tell you that's that's all. Like, I don't know how to even how to be even more honest with you. I, I'm a pretty transparent person. I, I know. I don't want to deter you one way, and then I, I'm pretty bad at lying. So like, I fall, and then like I'm just trying to avoid all that. Right. I just put these in the car. Wish we had pickles on that sandwich. Dude, it was starving. <laughs> Yeah, James. So on Twitter, I mean, nobody's DMing you this stuff. I mean, James, come on. Like, I'm not. I'm not mad. I'm just know, really worn out. I woke up like at four in the morning today. I mean, James. There's been in in four years of kind of dabbling in this stuff. 
there's been nobody to spam this to you or to try to get you into this stuff. I just, I mean, James, that, that's just horseshit. I mean, it seems like you're covering for them in some type of way. I mean, you, you got to be honest, because first you told me there were zero other miners you talked to, then you talked to Carla, and then you tell me that, well, when I have a girlfriend, I kind of just ignore everybody else. But you talked to Carla when you were talking to uh, Ariel. Well, that was when I started first talking to, started talking to Ariel, so it was kind of like, who to pick? Yeah, I understand. I understand. When's the last time you watched? A couple days ago. Okay. So you don't block it all out when you're talking to a girl? No. Not, not. Like, okay. I, I watch because that's my relief. Yeah, I understand that. Yeah, dude. So, look, I'm not saying you're some kingpin trader or whatever, but I know you've interacted with some traders online. I know you have. No, I haven't. No? I can honestly tell you. I'm, like, if I could tell you, like, if I had a trader, I would tell you, but I don't know. How I, do you know I, what a trader is? Because you just said it. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm like connecting the dots, like, okay, someone that trades. Right. It's just James, like, you hop into these, these not safe for work Twitters, you see all the menus of these young girls. And I, and I venture into them and I mm -hmm. go down the rabbit hole and that's as far as I go. Okay. And I, my, my imagination just runs wild, like, what if this was me with them, like, and it's not a great thought, honestly. Right. But it, it's like that adrenaline rush. Yeah, it's, is it because it's like taboo or something? Yeah, I guess so. Okay. Imagine if this was me with them. Okay, so are, the, are, you, are you like watching a video thinking this or what? Yeah, but not, it doesn't last long because I, I get grossed out of it. Okay, what's happening in these videos? They're just showing the body. Okay, imagine if this was me with them. So it kind of seems like you're putting yourself into someone else's shoes. Like, next to them, like, if they were, like, they're playing with their body, like, okay. like, they're, 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 they're yeah. okay. and I just imagine, like, what if it was me doing that? All right. When's the last time you were showing a video of someone like that, with a girl like that? Um, like, of underage? Mm -hmm. mm, before Ariel. No. After Ariel? Obviously before Ariel, but... Okay. It was back when I had Twitter. When did you get off Twitter? Well, I got banned. I'm assuming because I was looking at this stuff. Yeah, James, they don't ban you for going and looking at a public post. Well, I also retweeted a lot of that stuff. You retweeted a lot of that stuff? No, 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 bad stuff. Like, if you... If my friends would vouch for me when they say, like, my stuff that I retweeted were uh -huh. kind of out of pocket like it was it was just weird things like not safe for work stuff but of age people but like they're just doing weird things how, how did you retweet those like just, retweet. just press retweet yeah. okay no like quote tweeting or anything i don't quote tweet okay yeah james you, you can't get banned for retweeting something there, there's just, there's just no way there's no way you can get banned for retweeting something because that's not you tweeting it that's just you sharing something i mean you know how many banned Twitter accounts that I've come across, like, you know, in the conservative political sphere that have been banned? Nobody's been banned for retweeting an account. I mean, that's that's crazy. I mean, that's like, I, I mean, it's a 20 follower account that's just retweeting, like, you know, say back then with Twitter, like, oh, uh, I'm against the vaccine or something, retweeting that type of stuff. They're not going to get banned, even with the old Twitter, how, how heavy with censorship they are, man. What got you banned? What do you think it could have been besides that? I might have gone... I might have been talking to some, like I said, I'm not. Might have been talking to who? I don't know, like a profile. Okay, what was the profile advertising or what was their shtick? Just not safe for work stuff. Okay. I didn't know the age, I couldn't tell. Okay, but. is 100% legal on Twitter. Like if I, if I were to take a picture of like a big dick, Yeah, if I were to take a picture of a big dick and post it, totally fine to post it. I mean, you see all these OnlyFans on Twitter, right? Just, God, even in like political comments, they're like, Oh, he's so screwed up, and they're showing their. So it's annoying. Yeah. They, they all, Twitter only bans underage stuff. They're pretty wild west with everything else. What do you think was happening that got you banned? I probably asked to see some stuff. Okay. Was well, some of the stuff something that probably you shouldn't be looking at? Probably. What do you think it was? Just okay. Names of who or of what? The person. Okay. How old was the person purporting to be? Uh, I don't know. Like, oh, reporting to be? Yeah. Over over the age, because they, they would put, minors do not, do not 
I, I don't know what the I stands for. Yeah. So what were you what were you looking for though? Um, I I just don't think you can get banned for talking in a DM or something. There has to be some picture exchange, man. I mean, I don't exchange pictures. Okay. Uh, if anything, I would like pictures of myself. But that's fine. Yeah. Did they? Okay. So if there was a picture, did they maybe ever send a picture like that to you to get y'all both banned? I, like, I'm trying to figure it out, man, because you didn't get banned from Twitter for retweeting or for DMing somebody. There's no way. I mean, I, I think I think you do. There's just kind of a disconnect here, man. Can you reword that question? Do you think they could have sent you an image of something younger to oh, get probably. you both banned? Probably. probably. I mean, how many times has something like that happened? Not much, because I got banned pretty quickly after that. Okay, after what? After talking to that person, I think. Okay, was that person sending you kind of child stuff? Not that I can tell, like, because there was no face. So I don't know, like age but it does i would assume that they're underage okay well what, what made you assume that their bodies look small okay because there's like petite 18 year olds i mean did this really look underage to you it's hard to tell like maybe 16 17 but it could be even less and they just have a, a bigger body yeah oh but here don't, don't shine that quite in his face i don't want that okay but even 16 17 can look well, it can look young, but it can look also like 18. Mm -hmm. I mean, James, I, I really think there's something, there's something under the surface that isn't being told. Let me know if it's too bright, man. There's something under the surface that isn't being told that I think somebody's shown you. I, I really do, because I don't think you look at, you know, some 13 year olds and 16, 17 year olds, then come here after saying all this nasty shit. I, I think it's just talking to that profile. That got you banned? I think, well, it, like we would talk, and like it was kind of like a relationship, like how this kind of ended. Mm -hmm. But um, and we showed pictures of each other. Did you guys ever discuss anything underage with each other, or just talk about it? Probably. Probably. Yeah. It, okay. What would y'all have talked about? Just doing things. With underage. With each other. Okay. So was she underage then? I, maybe. Well, I think you would have known. I mean, how old did she tell she was? Like I said, like. It's, their age says that they're over of age, but uh -huh. I think they're younger than that. Okay, how old did you think that girl was? Oh, like 15. 15, okay. And you said you exchanged pictures with each other? Okay, what kind of pictures? Of each other, like. Okay, so this, how, how long ago was this 15 year old sending you that stuff? Back when I had Twitter, like a couple years ago, like four years ago. Four years ago, okay. And then that like, was like, this was, that gave me the like, is this possible? Like, am I, is there, are they really sending me this stuff? That's so crazy. this was the, so that was that, you think that was the catalyst? I think so, because it's like, how am I doing this? Right, right. You know? It's like a boundary you just think you can never cross. Yeah. Okay, that makes, that makes sense. So it's not, it's, it's, it's more curiosity. It's not you like, just, oh, I just want to go, you know, and all that stupid shit. Okay. Yeah, okay. So if it's that 15 year old four years ago at first doing this, I mean, how long i i mean there's no way this level there's just no way i i've never this is the first time i've ever gone somewhere for something oh i believe that part i believe that part i'm trust me i'm not even gonna ask you about meeting anybody else i believe that part what i don't necessarily believe is everything that happened in between this what happened with that you know who you think is a 15 year old i don't know who the f it would have been or to now i think that four years some really up shit has come across your thing to f your mind up I really think that's what it is. Because you mentioned you're in a drug group. I think this is like a drug. I know in that drug group there's nothing. It, it, it is like a drug. You, you think a drug that tries heroin for the first time is like, ah, nah, that was cool. I really liked it, but nah. It's the same thing, man. The, the dopamine hits, all this type of stuff. And I know, dude, I know this is hard to talk about. I know that, dude, like, and that's, you mentioned I'm, mad. I'm not mad, again, just waking up at 4 a.m. I'd be truly weirded out and mad if you just told me the full truth about everything immediately because then I'll be like, oh my God, this guy's a sociopath and he enjoys this shit. I don't think you do. I think you desperately want some help for this or at least some guidance. Like I said, I tried talking to my therapist about it. But what did your therapist say? He was like, oh, well, you kind of have to figure that out yourself. That's kind of like my growth. And that was about it. I kind of felt uncomfortable talking about it much more. So I was like, okay, let me just stop there. What did you exactly tell him? I find myself attracted to younger girls around high school age. Mm -hmm. And 
I don't enjoy that, but I think these things where I want to do with them, and I don't want to do that. I don't want to be seen of that, like that person. That you don't want to be that guy that you hear about on the news and exactly, all that type yeah. of stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and you know that that kind of tells me that the past four years, you, there's absolutely been some shit that they've shown you. Absolutely. It's 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 a it's a hunger, man. It's a hunger. You know, I, I know you don't appreciate it, you don't like it, but it, it is it is a hunger. And I'm telling you because I think you need that reality check, and you're you're, you're young enough to process that reality check. Oh, we didn't, we didn't even call him. Oh, was, yeah, no. Hello. How's it going? Good. Oh yeah, though there's just kind of like a there's just kind of like a situation here. Um, we're just having a mutual conversation, and um, I mean you're not going to try to meet a 13 year old for s again, are you? Last time doing that? Yeah. Okay. And you're not going to look at child ever again online? I, I hope not to come across it, and I plan on not trying to not come across it. I'm doing what I can to avoid all that. Okay, and um, yeah, this should be your first and last time trying to meet a 13 year old. Do you understand that? Okay, well, he said what was happening on your body cam there, and uh... Do you have any idea on you? Yeah. Can I get it in my car? Is that okay? Where's it going to be? Um, in the middle. Do you have any weapons or anything? Can you blow it off the door slow? Go ahead and grab your... Oh, he's 100% seen some f***ed up shit. Oh, we were posing a set 13 year old girl. 
food in this t-shirt for her too. Yeah, it's on the uh, yeah, passenger it's like seat. A, is it paper seat? Yes, sir. We, we have it all digitally too. But... What's up, everybody? What's up? What's up? Sounds good, Sam Squish. Thank you, Stud Control, for 20. This is for the upgrades on the master class on Ruby V. Oh, I appreciate it, Sarah. Really appreciate There's everybody that donated. Yeah. Huh? Uh, There's another cop car that pulled up. She. Hey, Sean's Renee. What's up? Thank you for joining this live catch. Thank you for being on the course. Hope you're doing good over there at Waffle yeah. House. The food is delicious. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Cheers. Thank you. Much love. Yeah, we are good. Yes, we are good. Yeah. Yeah, so we do have disposable ice packs so just in case, but um, you know, I presume we're going to get that one. Oh, yeah, yeah. Currently enjoying uh, the board well, of spaghetti rolls and the pipe in the back. It's going to make you blush. Thanks for your equipment upgrades up. It was long overdue. We had to get a lot of mic. Thank you, Lynn Daughter. Thank you, thank you. Yes, hey, Susan's back. You want to say hi to the gang? Yeah, Ryan, he doesn't want to be on camera. Yeah, I'll right in my face, bro. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, you want to say hi? <laughs> Sam Squanch. Did you? Yeah, she's just thinking. Hola, mi amigo. Sorry, mi español es poquito. Trip, 
Um, it's not gonna be too long. Probably one of the shortest we've had in while. Appreciate it, Miranda. Yeah, just hit up Alex. Uh, you know, on the socials. Or, or have any, so you know. yeah, Just hit up Alex. My aggressive sexual cred should be busted at the end of the trip. I, I hope so, APP. Thank you, Symbol. I don't know how to pronounce it. I don't want to butcher it. For the ten dollars, miss you, Pablo. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, XOXO. Thank you so much for the ten dollars. Appreciate everybody that do donate. Seriously, if I did miss any, I'm sorry. Uh, you know, I can't read the chat during during the live stream. Yeah, the five is still talking too much. So. I think the Pred needed a therapist. <laughs> oh, he needs more than that. He's the only therapist he needs. It's like when... Yo, coming up this way, Pablo. Uh, where? I don't think... We're not going all the way up there, right? Where? New York. You know the highest we're going to? I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think we're going all the way up there, Dean. Another one. Damn, another cop car. It's four. I think, I think, I think the... Uh, There's probably nothing to do. The most nor northern state we're going to go is probably North Carolina. Thank uh, you, Street Bees, for oh, 10 man. bucks. Oh, he's getting cuffed. Let's go, guys. There you go, locals. There you go, locals. Right there. This is, this is y'all's money being put into work right here. guys if you liked what you saw then make sure you join locals in the pinned comment right there or if you're on rumble press the red join button really helps us out um we don't even know if this video is going to be on youtube youtube is so flimsy with uh keeping good stuff on um so if you want to help support the cause locals down in the pinned comment you can see over 21 catches early including you could have seen this probably a month early all uncensored all early and plus as you see we travel the most and catch the sickest so be sure to help support that. We go nationwide, and it's only possible because of people like you. So press that red join button on Rumble or press the support button in the pinned comment on YouTube, locals pinned comment, and join up. Hope to see you on there. Every other live stream, um, every other live catch is on locals, including this one, which we just live streamed on locals. So don't want to miss it. Travel most, catch sick, and be a part of that pinned comment.